देख ले है ना लेकिन जस्ट उससे पहले लेट्स टेक अ मिनट टू सोक इन द लव दैट डार्लिंग्स हैज गॉट सिंस इट्स लॉन्च ऑन नेटफ्लिक्स लेट्स वॉच या रील्स एंड एवरीथिंग जस्ट बीइंग मेड ऑन डार्लिंग्स राइट हाउ डज इट फील दैट अ फिल्म लाइक दिस सो क्विकली is so loved by everyone in the world and it happens to be the first collaboration between Netflix and Netflix and Eternal Sunshine together how does that feel and can you tell us more about this experience please malika why are you being so serious i love your humor ye koi sawal hai puchne lag rahe hai kya hai puchu mab mab mere ko nice ke liye the hello acha theek hai let me twist this no no bilkul twist hi ab main iska jawab there is really nothing that i can uh, you know add to how the film is performed the love it has got from everyone uh, sapne uh, akansha hai the numbers but you have seen everything here it's done incredibly well um we i mean just as netflix it's been a very very special film for us and it's been a special journey and very rarely do you get a chance to put a story out which uh, you know uh touches a chord uh tackles an issue brings you incredible entertainment and does all of it uh you know in in uh, you know such an effortless way so i think darlings has been very beautiful very effortless very impactful in every which way that it can be does that answer malika uh, does it media walo <laughs> yes yes they are very very happy uh and now uh, hello jasmeet how's you very good thank you jab humne last baat ki thi tab film nikli nahi thi aur ab nikal ke aise nikli hai so i have to ask you after everything that happened now ab mujhe aap batao who's who is the biggest darling on set me okay you are my life yes. darling so <laughs> <laughs> sabhi apne apne darling the तो शिफाली जी एक बात बताइए पल में शक्शु पल में मैडम सर मतलब Oh please I don't know how it is because most of my work comes out of instinct uh and uh, I go there believing and it's not like I psych myself to believe it but I actually go there believing that I don't know so it's a great place to start every she knows everything no one will believe this no one will believe this no one will believe this ki vartika ma'am ko pata nahi ki wo kya kar rahi hai um vijay But I wanted to ask you a question. Ki, uh, how are you dealing with all the love that you're getting, Vijay Verma, and all the hate that Hamza is getting? Like, how? What do you? How do you reason this? I feel like it's a perfect balance, right? Hamza deserves all the hate that he's getting. That's true. And Vijay is getting all the love that he's deserving. Yeah. So we live in a very fair world. It's poetic justice. Thank you so much. बारिंग <laughs> mind blowing cast i mean i can't even digest it but at what point did you know that this was the perfect choice for netflix i think from the first time we discussed this film uh, you know uh, with with venturees and uh, we just sort of discussed the idea what they have made um, i think there was just no doubt in my mind no doubt in our mind as a team that uh, this was something that only and only belonged on netflix and uh, because uh, of uh, uh, you know how we can take it to our audiences and i think the way uh, the entire team that has you know the task force everybody working 
on taking the uh, film out, rolling out the campaign, doing the stories, taking all this wonderful cast and director to the world out there. I think uh, we just knew that we could do a special job. This was the most special film and the global audiences had to see it. So Netflix is the only option. Mm -hmm. And now we have a couple of questions from the audience as well. So before we let you all go, let's take a question from Komal from PTI. This one's for all of you. And the question is, tell us the best thing you've heard about darlings from the audience. Ek ek karke, please. Roshan, start. No, it starts with Monica. Good job, guys. Good job throwing me under the bus first. No, I think uh, one of the most sensible things I heard was that um, somebody called me up and said, uh, yeah, it's a great film, um, it's a really brave film, but the most effective part of the film is that it conveys whatever it has to say through humor, that the humor stays alive, the entertainment stays alive, so everyone who's watching the film will get to the end of the film. And then whatever discussions happen it or will happen after it or whatever they take away from it is, uh, is good. So. I, I felt like that was great. That's also something I thought when I first read the script that I love the fact that this is a film that makes you laugh in the absurdest of situations. Uh, mostly thanks to you, who the food is so good. I said, what? Can you please say that again? And then I say this time to everyone now. And the next one is for Shifali from Usha at Big FM and she wants to know you are basking in the glory right now of a successful return on death crime and a hit darlings. How does it feel and how soon are we seeing you next because we need to? Uh, how soon are we seeing you next? I mean, I want to get to work tomorrow but <laughs> I'm waiting. So, how does it feel? I mean, I don't know how long is this program. I don't even know where to start. So, I'm just... I mean, what can I say that can justify or explain or uh, articulate what I'm thinking? It's not possible. It's not possible. It's so overwhelming and it's so wonderful. Is that it? I have completed the sentence. You're welcome. And on that note, Roshan, please tell us that how different is it to work in our amazing industry here and in the Malayalam film industry? I have to say I'm getting this question for the first time. Yeah, yeah. That's just how I roll, bro. <laughs> It's definitely different, um, but once you get past the differences that are superficial, I feel like eventually we're doing the same job there and we're doing the same job here. So as far as an actor's job is concerned, I don't, I don't think I did anything um, that was starkly different in the way I work a project there or here. Of course, Darlings required a lot more prep. I worked on the uh, lines with Jasmeet quite a bit. I worked on getting the slang or like, as far as I got the slang, I think Jasmeet helped me a lot. We had a dialect coach uh, who helped me. So that sort of prep obviously happened for this one. Mm, everything was a little more planned and like organized and things were put down on Excel sheets and stuff that I've never seen in my life. <laughs> we, don't, we don't work a lot on the laptop. Uh, so that was that. But yeah, then like COVID happened and this whole like planning and the whole process sort of imploded. So by the time we got on the floor and we were shooting, it felt very similar to doing a film down south. Thank you so much.